Pretty cool. Did you see we were doing the co uh, the co side quest? I don't like his voice. <sighs> okay, so we've got two, four, six. And a long rest. Let's long rest. Yeah, I've got three side quests to do before the final chapter. So I may as well do them. I mean, I'm, I'm level 10, but... May as well explore it. Okay. So... You would have expected... You would have expected these rune things to light up. So, am I supposed to do the diagrams in the... Am I supposed to do the diagrams in the, in the thing? No. Maybe I have to stay on one. Oh, so we have to stay on. Okay. Thanks. Oh, right. So even though there are four edges, we have to have the whole outer bit. Well, we can't. Huh? Three, four, five. Four, three, three. Four, four. Are they instructions? War of the Gods. Schism of Arivad. I seem like this is like a, a guide. The primal gods formed a balance to ensemble when mankind rose on Tema. Arun was the first, America with him, Pakri and Evrivad came into being and consolidated the quartet. Arun rose and was higher than... So it's like a story, right? No worries, Ethereal. Catch you in a bit. Uh, higher than the others. First and mightiest. Then Arun stood aside as desiring... So I think you have to change the shape. But that one, that one doesn't look like the fight. Maybe, maybe it does. Then run stood aside, uh, desiring above all balance between the gods. Packer had been watching this whole time. She took a more central role to bring balance to mankind. The dark days came and men prayed for a strong god to protect them against Saw Akath. Arvad descended a new ladder leader of the gods. <laughs> ladder of the gods. Sorata corrupted Arvad, causing the schism. Arvad split into two entities. Enar was born. Uh, Arvad clean of all corruption. Arvad remained fire pretended. There were no longer four, but five. So, there's a square here, which is a bit weird. Maybe we have to, maybe it's not just, no, no longer four. Maybe I have to like change the shape 
mid. So one up, one down. I can't do anything to get this to bloody... Light up. The temple's door is locked. It looks like a puzzle or riddle needs to be solved. Information might be found in the writings of the wall of the temple. Let's try it from the other side, I guess. That box is weird. Because the other ones have lines drawn between them. Let's try. Let's try like a mini box. No. I need this to be on quick slot. I've tried the small. There's a little line there. So then let's move from this to the other one. That's not lit up, so let's try. God damn it. Wow. I am puzzled, puzzled. Try this way around. This way around. Holy hell. I don't get this at all. So for the three, maybe it's Hey Raz, no worries, man. Hope you're well. So it's like maybe it's like this. No. This puzzle is pretty bad, is it? Don't be helping me. Be lurking. You got shit to do. I'm watching it. You had to Google it as well. Ethereal just said exactly the same thing. <laughs> I'm doubly motivated to give it a try now. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Maybe you have to go from right to left. So this one here. But in the story, it said that there were no longer four, but five. Which feels like the end of the story. I can't seem to light up any of these runes. I feel like you're supposed to go from left to right, and I think that you're supposed to... 
transition the shapes into the ones to unlock at the door. But for some reason, whatever shape I try, it doesn't work. I did look at the book, yeah. The book is a little bit confusing as well because it has a... It has like a... This seems too overly simplistic and there's a little line here. Oh, the rest of them have got like shapes. Is it that we have to start with the small and then move to the large? Or start with the large and then move to the small? Let's start with the small and then move to the large. I think I did that already, actually. And then... No. And this one up. The symbol will light up if you get it correct. Okay. I feel like at this point, I should have got at least one of them correct randomly. Maybe it's this side for the square. Maybe. Hello, Sam. Maybe it's... Literal. Like it's the back here. There, there you go. Um, so then... You have to move these two up there. Okay. So we have to move these guys to a specific. Yeah, yeah, I thought, yeah, I thought as much. I think we have to, the transition is clearly the important part. So to move to the, from the small square. I think the line might be a clue. Maybe not. These two are already in place. So... It feels like we should just be able to move the other two up, but I tried that. Maybe I moved the wrong one first? No. No, as soon as I leave... Hey, Rooster, how you doing? As soon as I leave the pressure plate, it seems to go. Yeah. So maybe it's these guys? Is it this back one? Yes. So... To the top? Nope. Think smaller. Oh. Thank you, Rooster. They don't exactly give you much help, do they? Uh, okay, okay, okay. Um, so then, if I remove him. I 
I move him. Shit. It's like two. Or maybe it's this one. Nope. I mean, you could really, you could brute force it, couldn't you? It's not this one. It's not him. It has to be this guy. Move the same guy. Okay. This is a, this is a terrible puzzle. <laughs> this is a terrible puzzle. <laughs> Do you always move the same guy? No. Okay. Because I, I think he moved the middle guy there. Yeah. Uh, and then I need to make a... So do I move him? Yeah. And then for the last one, I need like three here. Oh, we, we're not four, but five, so. Whew. There you have it. Uh, let's save. I never want to do that again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was an interesting puzzle, but I, I imagine most people Googled that. Is the, the... Oh, we have to defeat that. Okay. One little dude. Two little dudes. I saved, I saved. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay. So, if we're going to get sneak attack on him. Let's have you with... What? Okay, dude. Yeah, I got the book. The problem with the book is that the... Um, the first symbol showed the four dots. Like, in the big square. And it made me think that you had to put the four dots in each corner. Okay, well, let's summon. As if. I guess we go for the ad first. Was one of my characters not in stealth? Because I feel like I should have been in stealth there. Oh no. They've got quite a lot of health. Yeah, maybe we failed to save uh, um, stealth check. Uh, Remor has tremor sense. He can detect. Okay. Well, it is what it is. Still unknown creature to me. Ugh, Arwen. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
If he has tremor sense, why has he not detected three of my characters? Is that not a bit weird? Shit. He does? Oh. Well. They can... They're also summoning... They're... They're... Subversive submari submarines. Sub they go under the ground. They're winged snakes that go underground. <laughs> retaliate. What the hell's retaliate and why is it killing my snake? They're like thorns. No. Oh, Dave. See, I would have taken a lot less damage there if I hadn't have changed to my stupid shield thing. Uh, crossbow, sorry. Right, let's do... Blight, maybe? Hmm. Hmm. Let's do haste. Nope. Let's do... I forgot that was concentration. Let's do... Hey, Confusion, how you doing? Let's do Acid. There we go. By the way, Confusion, uh... Uh, there you go. It's a lot of quotes, my friend. Uh, shoot that. Excellent. Okay. I gotta have to be careful about retaliate. So you're saying that we have how do we have Is it rope grapple? Is that is that the ranged attack? He has no different weapons to use. So just try rope grapple. Hmm. Just click on them? Oh, click on the weapon? Well, I have to wait now. 